excuse, because I know it's getting late. Um, the second to last one is for our city volunteers. Doesn't matter if you're a Riverwalk volunteer, doesn't matter if you're a volunteer to feed the homeless, if you're a volunteer to help those people living with AIDS, you're volunteering at Stranahan House. I look around this room and I look at almost every table. And I'm, I'm looking over here with Marty and other people from Patriot National. You go to them for something in downtown, Patriot National steps up. Marty Kurtz has been my appointment on so many boards, it's, it's crazy. But I can go table with table. I go Steve and I go Mark and folks, your volunteerism has made our life so much better because you're taking the strain and the stress off city government. If that service can be provided by somebody stepping up to volunteer, you're helping us. And I think as you all probably have realized over the last 10 years, your volunteering is probably helping you too. Probably keeping you younger, keeping you more vibrant. I mean, you walk into a project at First Baptist when they've got everything going on with the activities and they're hosting something, and they're running around, you'd think they'd be so stressed because they've got to get this event pulled off, and I imagine with the next couple weeks, what's going on with your show? But the smiles of everybody that greets you, yeah, they're stressed, they've got to get the next performance on, they've got to do this, but they're making a difference. And in the process, they're making a difference in their own life. So to all our volunteers, whether it's Riverwalk, whether it's for the Chamber, i got to thank you.